Ty Majeski captures one of the most prize wins in the super late model world. He is the winner of the 56th running of the Snowball Derby at Five Flag Speedway in Pensacola. Gio Ruggiero is in second and in the third position, Travis Braden. Great to see him with a good result after coming back to racing in a more full-time capacity this year. I would say this was a tale of two races. The first part of this race, there was caution after caution after caution. Then we were hit with pretty long green flag runs. And then of course, as the laps wind down, things get a little bit more chaotic. For instance, with less than 25 laps to go, we had the big one. This wreck took out some Cup Series favorites like William Byron and Eric Jones, who were going after the snowball win. This happened as a result of Noah Gregson seemingly missing a shift or a gear on that restart. So very unfortunate there for quite a few people in the field. And then around eight to go, and I would chalk this up to just some intense racing, there was a battle for the lead brewing between the rivals of Steven Nassi and Bubba Pollard. As is typical in short track racing, Pollard in the number 26 tapped the bumper of Steven Nassi in the 51, moving him up the track. And as the 26 got underneath, there just wasn't enough room for both of them. This led to both of them making contact with each other, Nassi going around, and both ending up with significant damage. Unfortunately, Pollard was not able to recover. He finished in the 19th position, but Steven Nassi was able to make a pretty decent recovery, finishing in 6th. So again, congrats to Ty Majeski on winning the 56th running of the Snowball Derby. A reminder, though, the racing is not over at Pensacola. We still have the Snowflake 100 that was supposed to happen on Saturday, but because of rain, they had to move it to Monday. So again, it'll be on Racing America starting at 3 p.m. Eastern time. So still more racing to go. Make sure you watch tomorrow.